Betty Ann Jones in Swansea in Wales. Uh, well, I think she beats us hands down. She, she has spent, can you believe this, £30,000 on her Christmas decorations over the years. 2,000 Christmas decorations in all, OK? So she's got something like 14,000 fairy lights. 14, and she gets 000. this out every year yeah. herself, does it all oh. herself, her and her husband, and they decorate the inside of their house and then let members of the public come in. Don't and they raise a lot of money for charity. For Let's go there live and find out. I bet wow. it's there with her husband Keith from their home in Swansea. It's hard to tell which is Where them. Where are you? Give us which a wave. Which is you and which is the, uh, the ornaments. Where are you guys? Give us a wave. Oh, dear. Oh, can I hear... Oh, oh there yes. they are. We are here in the <laughs> street. Hello, Bessie, we could hardly see you there. Now, what room of your house are you in? What would that normally be? At the moment in time, we're in the dining room. This uh, is the hardest room for me to do because I empty it completely, this room. But before I start, who looks the best, Keith or I? Oh, it's definitely you, Bessie, <laughs> hands down. Sorry, uh... Keith. I mean, you look very nice, but <laughs> Bessie's got the edge. Bye. Lots of us love Christmas, lots of us decorate our homes, but yours is to the max. Uh, how did this all start? Yes. It started years ago, and I opened a care home back in 1989. Um, eight, 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 and, of course, the old... Uh, well, the residents, they enjoyed Christmas. So it started from then. Well, as you say, I've got all these, but I've been collecting the ornaments and for over 50 years. It's not as if I'd gone out and spent 30,000 on them at one go. But um, as you can see, I love Christmas and I hope I bring a lot of joy. I know I bring a joy to the children because they come here and it's magical. But and now, I, this but is now very Betty, difficult that's to do going to stop. I emptied it. You're going to stop now. Um, you're not going to bring that joy anymore. And, and why have you decided to stop? Uh, now, uh, what I have said... I will stop emptying the room because this has been very difficult for me because I do it on my own and I'm up and down the ladders and I'm 76 years of age. I'm not getting any younger. But what I'd like, a little chalet outside <laughs> and I could decorate it all. Keith, is this where you come in? Betty's saying she's doing this on her own. So what are you doing when she's doing all that? And is she yes. giving you a hint there that she wants a chalet in the garden? Well, I did start this year to help her, but it, it all fell down. So after that, <laughs> she'd done it all herself. Because only what she does is right anyway. Typical to every woman, isn't it? Oh. But, um, no, <laughs> she, does, she does work hard, yeah. They, do, they can't do it good enough. So, obviously, I've got a standard. And if you look around, you can't even see it any wires or leads or anything. It's but amazing. it does take me a long time, and that's why I start in August. I was just... Yeah, Betty, you read and my mind. I was just about now. to say, when do you start doing this? So you start in August. It August. takes you all that time. And this year I started... And this year I started and I had broke, two bones broken in my foot, so I really, really struggled. But I did it, and I'm happy I've done it, and everybody that's been this year, and we've had fun and... I've had helpers. I'm Santa's, I'm Santa's little helper today. Oh, show us around <laughs> you too. Show, show so us around. Anyway, Let me give us, since this is going to be the last year, show us exactly what you've got. As you can see, I've got over 50 um, Father Christmas in this room with 15 Christmas trees. In Behind Keith, I've got the dolls dressed up in Kerry John's 24. That's his first outfit. Then there's Nia Wynn, her outfit. And Nanga Harad, she's 28, and that's her outfit. And as you can see, these plastic uh, Father Christmases, people threw out. I mean, I bought them for the children 28 years ago and 24 years ago. My daughter lived through them out, I took them in. <laughs> and they scattered around the place so, on the walls. As you can see, there's a stocking. Every member of the family have got their names on. And... Um, well, if nobody else likes it in the family, I enjoy doing it. <laughs> yes. So we can tell we'll go into this room now. This is the snowman room. Oh, I love this room. It's normally a television lovely. room. And there's 75 snowmen here. And that one, well, you can see the plastic ones. I mean, probably you'd throw them out. You wouldn't want them. If you do, send them down to me. <laughs> oh, we, just we bought the snowman tree this year in Florida. How many people come back from Florida with a six-foot-six uh, snowman tree? 
<laughs> Have you decorated the loo as well? I see something unusual. You know, yes, and I've got things from Las Vegas. When people go away, they brought me from Boston. You can see them uh. from New York. You name it, they're from everywhere. Well, Betty Ann, you're an absolute and legend. We went to the you're German a legend. Mark. Thank you very much indeed. We're just going to get a word from Santa. Uh, maybe if we get, get a word from Santa, because he's been viewing um, what, you've, what you've seen there, and we're going to find out what he thinks and if he's, how he gets down your chimney. S Santa, you've seen everything there. How would you rate Betty Ann's home? <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm so impressed. I've never seen such a fantastic assortment. I mean, well done to her. She's on my nice list, I'll say that. Yo, <laughs> yo, there's the ultimate endorsement. Thank oh, you very thank much. You. Thank you. Happy, happy Christmas. And um, I have to just tell everybody as well that over the years, Betty's raised £73,000 for Macmillan Charity. Well, well done. All her hard well done. work. Well done. Um, Keith, you look as, about, as thrilled about Christmas as my husband. But have a happy time, the both of you, and yes, yes. lovely to talk <laughs> to can you. I, can I? <laughs> See? I'm only checking the electrics, that's all I do.